To me, the largest area of work for the future, energy and water, are the real solutions to health, livelihood, all of the stuff that goes above it. Most people don't realize, but half the world either has no electricity or electricity two, three hours a day. Everything requires energy. Energy is the great equalizer. So you try to look for that which is the one thing that will lead to benefits that are across hundreds of things. Human mechanical energy is so amazing. Why can't we use that to create energy? So we've invented a hybrid bicycle that you pedal for an hour and you have electricity for 24 hours. We call it free electric. The free electric, I think, is the coolest of all our inventions. And yet it's gonna affect maybe have the largest effect of anything in the last 100 years. The reason is, for the poor half of the world, they have electricity 24-7. Electricity is the greatest enabler there is. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Also, if you look at worldwide, the other side is really interesting. Hurricane Katrina was a Category 5 monster that became the costliest disaster ever in the US. If a disaster happens, you don't want to be out of touch. and You don't want to be in the dark. The worst is being without a cell phone and in the dark. <laughs> so you're alone in the dark. You have this, you will never run out of electricity. And you never generate any pollution. So half the world is not gonna generate pollution in their homes. With human energy and working out a lot of the efficiencies, we're able to go and power 1,050 equivalent watts of lighting and energy. So when, when does this start to get to a point where it lights up everything? Well, actually, right about now, there, it is. there we go. Pedal for an hour and you can have lights, charge your phone and everything else throughout the night. This is the cheapest, most practical way of getting electricity throughout the world. So now, all of a sudden, all of these poor that were not contributing anything to their outside world, now they're all bringing it up. All of a sudden, they're on the internet. They're getting information on, on uh, all of a sudden, they're getting educated. The real thing is to get the, the poor out of their poverty. And one of the basics is energy. I mean, think about it. The poor half stay the poor half because they have no power. They have no energy. That's one of the most fundamental things. The world can be changed. It takes a crusader.